Now, the next part of the global infrastructure to stress on is going to be edge locations or what is known also as POPs, points of presence. We mentioned in the previous video AWS regions and AZs, which helped a lot in presenting the applications to global users that are located in multiple parts of the world. But AWS does not have a presence in each country and every location all over the world. What about I need to get closer to my global users? Think about a media streaming application for video on demand as Netflix for example, it has its media files, our favorite movies, and series, stored somewhere in the US. The subscribers to Netflix service are dispersed all over the world, even in countries that do not have a local region over there. Each one of them wants to start streaming multimedia to their end. If each would stream their requested multimedia from the source or what we would refer to as the origin, which is located in the US, some of them, the close ones, would have an excellent experience, while others who are relatively far away would have bad user experience. We need to get closer to the users, and we need to maintain the same end-user experience, even if you are located in a location different from the AWS region. So, how can we do this? Well, AWS has hundreds of other locations around the world known as edge locations or POPs, which serve as another alternative to store copies of my data. Besides the origin, where the data is originally hosted, I'll start using the POPs all over the world to store copies of my data. This process is also known as caching. The client requests will now be redirected to be served from a nearby cache location, and that will definitely speed up the response and improve the end user experience. Amazon CloudFront is a service from AWS that will make use of AWS Edge locations and POPs to store cached copies of your data for faster delivery to the customers. This is a very popular concept for delivering content with optimal performance, known in the market by the name of Content Delivery Networks, or CDN.